What's up guys this is Shivain and today I'm going to show you how you can fix your Chrome browser if it is hijacked by some malware. So if you search anything on Google and instead of searching it on Google it searches it on Yahoo or some other search engine that means that it has been hijacked. So just so you can understand what I'm saying. So as you can see my default search engine is Google but whenever I go to a new tab and search for anything it shows result on Yahoo so my basically my Google Chrome has been hijacked by Yahoo search engine and this is because of some malicious data so as you can see in the new tab this is actually this is not actually an original tab of Google Chrome this is some third party new tab so to fix this there are three things that you can do depending on how it has affected your browser so first is the easiest way of them and that is that you can just go to the settings option on the top right hand corner of the new tab and deselect set as default new page and use as default search. So if you do that and open up a new tab again it should work perfectly fine now. But if it doesn't like in my case then there are two more options that you can try. First is being installing a third party software to counter this malicious data and I'll link this in the description below for you to check out. This is add w cleaner version 7.0.3.1 which is the latest version right now. So I'll link this in the description and you just basically have to download it, install it and then run this and then it should work fine. But the thing is that you actually don't have to do even this. If only your browser is affected by this malware then you just have to reinstall that browser which doesn't require any third party software. So to check that you just have to search on another browser and if it is working fine then you don't have to install this. So for example uh, I went to Microsoft Edge and its default search is ping so it's perfectly working fine. So I just reinstalled Chrome and then it worked fine perfectly fine actually again so I didn't have to install the ADW cleaner or whatever it was called but if your multiple browsers are affected by this then you have to install that software so thank you for watching guys I hope that this video helped you guys to solve this problem I'll see you in the next video please like this video if it helped you and subscribe to my channel for more content I'll see you in the next video bye